13886. Hello everyone, welcome to my third polar bear challenge video and my second solar bear challenge video. It's finally starting to get cold in Minnesota. We're at 16 degrees today and the next couple looks like we're going to make it into single digits with maybe even zero by the weekend. I recorded this video on Wednesday morning. I wish I would have recorded it on Thursday morning instead. Today was much colder and the sky was a beautiful shade of blue and it was very sunny. Uh, Wednesday morning, as you can see, it was just a bit cloudy. The sun was trying to peek through the clouds and by the end of the day it finally did. But a couple of you had asked on my blog why I wasn't running around the signs anymore during this year's Solar Bear Challenge. Well, we have a different judge, and he changed the rules a little bit to make the challenge a bit safer. Running around a sign in the middle of the road is probably not the best idea in the world. So his requirement is that you pull off to a safe spot um, if the, where the sign is located isn't safe, and then uh, dance or run or jump around your bike. I think part of the reason people are asking me about that is this video when I did the Old Town Drive for the O in Solar Bear last year and was falling into this giant snow pit up to my waist. So if you haven't seen that video, I invite you to go back in my archives from last year and check out the video. I'll try to put a link below in the description. And if we can get some snow, I'd love to actually try to do this again. But uh, right now we only have a couple inches on the ground. So we need a bunch more before I can actually fall into a snowbank again. Which, by the way, was very fun. Today's solar bear challenge was to find a straight arrow. You can see it on the right, highlighted by the big red arrow, the one-way sign. Huh, that is the straight arrow sign. We're going to do the solar bear challenge. So, solar bear, solar bear, solar bear, solar bear, solar bear. Solar bear. One, three, nine, two, two.